Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Jessica Dean. In other news tonight, Upper Darby police are simply baffled after a man showed up to the station drunk and admitted to driving there while intoxicated. CBS 3's Joe Holden has the details of this unusual encounter. A man who apparently had way too much to drink and was driving decides to call it a night, and he pulls in here. File this one under. I've never seen anybody who's drunk come to the police station looking for a safe place. But that's what Upper Darby Township officers say Sean McCullough was up to early Wednesday morning. Watching the surveillance video, police say McCullough turns into the driveway, the Upper Darby Township police driveway, and proceeds to bang up their automatic gate. Goes on the outside, goes over the curb on the grass plot, and then comes into the lot and parks. Officers inside the building saw him on their monitors. They didn't know what was what was up. They ran out, got to him, and he's totally, totally blitzed. Police say they didn't exactly get a straight answer from the unsteady driver who lives in Havertown. They tell him to sit down on the curb. He falls down. They asked him, you know, where was he drinking? He said he wasn't sure if it was in Philly or Trenton. He had 12 to 14 beers. Philly, Trenton, a dozen beers or more maybe. The details were sketchy. And he kept on saying, I'm hammered, I'm hammered, I'm hammered, I'm hammered, I'm drunk, I'm drunk, I'm drunk. So they locked him up. Usually people are avoiding the police. They're running away from the police. This guy's coming into the police station. And we tried repeatedly to reach out to Sean McCall to get his side of the story. In fact, a number listed for his house was busy all day. In Upper Darby Township, Joe Holden, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.